offer for crab apple landscape. Uh, today I want to show you how I'm going to plant some seeds. This is my favorite foxglove, apricot fairy foxgloves, and I need to plant them now in midsummer in order for them to be little plants by the time I get them ready to plant in October, November. This seed packet from um, Renee's garden and it's the, just the prettiest apricot. It's a peachy color. I have set up a tray, a couple trays, with their individual cells, and I they were clean to begin with. They, it's important that they're clean. Filled them with potting soil, fresh potting soil, dry, and it shouldn't be wet. It should just be moist. And I am going to tap out some seeds. There's lots of seeds. Let's just have enough to share with our neighbors. So. On the back of the packet, there are instructions you need to read, and the idea is some seeds need to be covered, they need to germinate in a darkness, whereas other seeds just need to be sprinkled on the top, like for example, poppy seeds. Poppy seeds cannot be covered or they won't sprout, but foxglove digitalis has to be covered. So I have some auxiliary potting soil here and I'm just going to sprinkle a little bit over the top to cover the seeds. It says a, an, eighth, an eighth of an inch. So once I get that done, I'm going to water them in, and this is very important. Water each cell. While these are sprouting, I'm going to be, take care to keep them out of the sun, make sure they don't dry out. Well, I check on them every single day and depending on the um, temperature and everything, I water them about oh, probably every other day. Okay, so the next thing that we have to do is we have to make a plant label. And this is in order so you know what the heck you have planted here. This is a slat from a mini blind that I have cut up and um, you know everybody throws out mini blind. This is is a wonderfully soft pencil that I bought at an art store. Eight B. This is the softest lead you can buy, and it makes a real nice mark on your label. So I, I'm just going to put this in the tray. About planting this time of year in the middle of summer is because some plants respond to daylight. We've had midsummer night and the days are now starting to get shorter and the nights are starting to get longer and that's optimum for foxgloves. Water them every other day and keep them in the shade. And smile. I'm smiling. <laughs> <laughs>